The cool thing about allergy shots is they're not medicine. They're our most effective therapy. They will last 25 to 30 years often after we quit. It will stop things from worsening. It will often get the allergies about 95% better, get asthma 75% better, get eczema 50% better, and fix something we call pollen food allergy as well. The downside to allergy shots is that you have a bad allergic reaction to treatment. So with that bad allergic reaction, we have to take precautions. We have to do it in a doctor's office. You have to stay 30 minutes each time. We have to start with a low dose. We have to go up to a high dose. So in a nutshell, an allergy shots regimen consists of doing a shot once or twice per week for the first about three months, and then once a month after that. And then that once a, once a month we do for five years. Now, another option is called allergy drops. There's some pluses and minuses to allergy shots and allergy drops. If you compare the two, allergy shots are nice because they can last often 25 to 30 years after you're done. They're only dosed once a month for about double the efficacy of what allergy drops are and they're covered by insurance. On the flip side, allergy drops are not covered by insurance. And so often we we'll run about three to $400 a month, about half the efficacy, and last usually about two-ish years after you quit doing it. All of the allergy treatments respond best to shots. Pets are especially difficult to treat with allergy drops, but you can do allergy drops at home, whereas allergy shots have to be done in the office.